Everyone, welcome back to Femacy Lighthouse. And before we get into your reading, I have a special announcement. Three spots only, okay? 50% off of 30-minute sessions. The reason why I did not post this to my IG is because it'll be sold out already on Instagram. And I wanted to give everybody else that watches me on YouTube an opportunity. If you are someone that I have on Instagram and you're looking to have a reading, that's fine. But I know that there's many other people that are on this platform that don't have an Instagram. So then they never get to hear about the sale, you know? So um we have three slots available all right so first come first serve it doesn't matter if you're coming from instagram as well but i just wanted to be able to tap into those that don't have an instagram account okay so um again you can send me a dm if you want to or you can email me for those of you that do not have instagram you can email me at nightly sincere at gmail.com that email can be found in the description box below of this video or it's also found in the description of the channel okay today i will be uploading taurus versus sagittarius and i'm also doing a love reading for scorpio so if you are not yet a member of the femacy lighthouse vip i will put the link for you to join in the comment section let's get started the moon is in leo spirit please speak to me in reference to energies that surround taurus talk to me about energies that surround taurus in the recent past messages for energies that are surrounding Taurus. So we have the Two of Pentacles energy. There's some confusion going on here. There's more than one option as I can see. There's a lot of chaos is what I'm feeling. I feel that someone's confused around you, whether it's you or someone else that you're dealing with. There's more than one option. So it's like, all right, what am I going to do about this? How should I handle that? All right, tell me more. You could be dealing with another earth sign for some of you, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Talk to me about the Two of Pentacles. Who is this Two of Pentacles energy coming out here in the recent past? All right, so we have the Justice card, Libra energy. So someone going back and forth about forgiving someone, all right? This individual, like I've been telling you, there's somebody around you that wants to make it right, okay? And I'm not saying that this person is ready to jump right into a relationship or anything like that. It just feels like they don't want to be on the outs with you. They don't want to have issues with you. So I feel like this individual is going back and forth about, should I reach out? Should I not? Should I just let it go? Is it worth it? Something like that is going on. It could also be you saying that to yourself. Talk to me about the justice card here. Why the justice card? Communication, you see? We have Sagittarius, Libra, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Somebody wants to communicate something that you are looking to hear, but are they just telling you what you want to hear? You know what I mean? So that they can have their way. That's what I'm questioning when it comes to this person. Is it authentic? I know that they're looking to speak to you. They're looking to get something off of their chest all right if you watch me every day we got the page of cups in the future so i felt like somebody was going to be reaching out to you and we also had this sense of somebody trying to squash it with you all right there's somebody that's going back and forth about if it's even worth it we do have communication here tell me more about this sagittarius energy coming out here talk to me about this eight of wands all right so we have this Nine of Swords energy coming out here, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, and then we have the Knight of Cups. It could be that you communicated something to this person, and I don't know what you said to this individual, but it's triggering them, all right? We have the Eight of Wands to the Nine of Swords. Whatever it was that you said, they can't get it off of their mind, and they're anxious and nervous about it. They're taking your words very personally, very seriously, why the Knight of Cups energy coming out here? Talk to me about the Knight of Cups. Why the Knight of Cups coming out here, please? Yeah, the Queen of Cups. They know that you're disturbed. I don't know who this is, all right? They feel like they have to come in as this Knight. Again, you're not impressed with a Knight energy, though. You're looking for a King. And if not a King, then the Emperor, which is better than the King. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like 
Yes, you are in your emotions. You are not feeling a certain situation. This person can identify that. It's like, how can I get Taurus on my side? How can I get Taurus to see my point of view? That's what I hear this person saying. Hmm. Now talk to me about the present. Spirit, talk to me about the present really quick when it comes to this energy. Yeah, the Ace of Cups. So if this is about a love situation and you question if this person loves you, this person absolutely does, all right? I feel that the both of you have a lot of emotion towards each other, but there's somebody here that keeps going back and forth, all right? That's the problem here. Someone needs to stop doing this. Whomever it is that's doing this, going back and forth about something, I don't know what they're going back and forth about, but it's interrupting the whole process. And I feel like you don't like the back and forth. So you communicated that to this Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Sagittarius, or it could be a Capricorn as well. Could be any sign, but it's like something was said to this person. And because you said whatever you said to them, they're triggered, all right? They're either triggered by what you said or what somebody else said, or what they heard. Nine of Swords, it's like they're worried, anxious, not knowing how to make things right, wanting justice, but not having peace right now. They're looking for peace, but it's like they can't find it. They thought that things were gonna be more peaceful, and they are not. So, it's like now there's action that's required on their behalf. That's what this is saying. And there seems to be a lot of mutual love between you and this person. So I don't know what the dilemma is. Talk to me about what's going on in the present. Talk to me. There's too much going on. There's too much going on as we can see. Seven of Cups energy. Why is that? Talk to me about the Seven of Cups. The Knight of Wands. Yeah. So this person feels, again, like I said yesterday, they feel like you have all of this going on. Seven of Cups, all right? I don't know what that is. A lot of you are entrepreneurs. A lot of you are businesswomen, businessmen. A lot of you are in school. There's a lot that you have going on. So that's how they're feeling your energy, but they also feel that you have other options, all of these other people around you. Okay, I still see them interested, Knight of Wands energy, but they're viewing you as a Seven of Cups. It's like, you know, he or she is too busy. This is what I got yesterday as well. So it's like, or he or she has all of these different cups. So, you know, that's probably part of the reason why I have to be careful when I approach this individual. It's like they have to be careful when they approach you because you have all of these seven cups. And for each of you, metaphorically, those seven cups are something different. All right. That could be business or it could be that there's a lot going on in your life right now. Or this could be your fan club. You know, the seven of cups is going to be different for each of you. They are aware of that, which is why they're approaching you with caution is what I feel. I feel like they can't wait to make something right is what I'm getting. It's like they have to make it right. They're adamant about squashing something. I don't know what this person wants to squash so bad with you, but that's the energy that I'm getting. They don't wanna let go of the memories with the Six of Cups coming out here, so they're not willing to stop this, okay? They don't want it to stop. Even if they're not talking to you, even if you guys are not communicating, they feel like they need to resolve this because internally it's just, it's really messing with them, okay? It's messing with their self-esteem is what it's doing to this individual. So they know that something needs to be done. Now talk to me about the future. Really quick here. Talk to me about the future. The strength card with the sun, Leo. Tell me more. Talk to me about the future. The page of pentacles, that's your energy. Queen of Pentacles. For some of you, this person needs your help in finding ways how to develop strategies for more income. Okay, it's like they're watching you become this entrepreneur and they want to know how you've done it or even if you're not an entrepreneur, you could be successful in whatever it is that you're doing or you could just know how to save money. And this person 
lacks knowledge in that area and so they want more information from you all right because if their money is not right their love life is not going to be right you know they're always going to be stressed about the dollar they're always going to be stressed about how to make ends meet so the thing is is that if something's wrong with their income that needs to be adjusted first that needs to be fixed okay someone could act like they got money all day but not have it at all all right the thing is is that someone can have the best job in the world but then now the things that they purchase are more expensive and so now someone may be in debt because of an expensive lifestyle something like that could be happening with someone all right for others of you this person wants to learn something from you and i feel that you will be guiding this person through that process if you want to taurus it's going to be completely up to you but it's like they're looking up to you in the future there they're viewing you as the queen of pentacles they're watching you expand and they're watching how you became successful in a particular area that i feel that they are lacking in and so they're looking for your guidance but they don't want to fight either so it's completely complex let's see what happens tomorrow all right so i want to thank you so much for watching if you're interested three slots only for 50 percent off of a private session with me today okay hit me up as soon as you watch this send me a dm on ig for those of you that do not have instagram email me nightly sincere at gmail.com and if you have my business number you can call me there thank you so much and take care